feeble humans. Let us give you our power. <laughs> Soon, you will become unable to resist this intoxicating power. Wake up! Ay, ay, ay. Crawl out of one hole and into another. You want to tell me what's going on here? Americano, see? Now what brings a bloke like you to this part of the world? Oh, hey, easy, whoever you are. <sighs> Name's Leon. Came here looking for this girl. Seen her? What, are you supposed to be a cop or something? Nah, you don't look the type. Maybe. Okay, let me guess. She's the president's daughter? <laughs> That's too good for a guess. Wanna start explaining? Psychic powers. Nah, <laughs> just kidding with you, amigo. I overheard one of the villagers talking something about the president's daughter in the church. And who might you be? Me llamo Luis Serra. I used to be a cop in Madrid. But now I'm just a good-for-nothing guy who happens to be quite the ladies' man. Why'd you quit? Phew, <sighs> policia. You put your life on the line. Nobody really appreciates you enough for it. Being a hero isn't what it's cracked up to be anymore. I used to be a cop myself. Only for a day, though. I thought I was bad. Somehow I managed to get myself involved with the incident in Raccoon City on my first day in the force. That is the incident with the viral outbreak, right? I think I might have seen a sample of the virus in a lab at the department. Hey boy, I'm not done. <laughs> Do something, cop! After you! Now! It's Leon. Sorry I couldn't get in touch sooner, but I was a bit tied up. You're okay, right? I'm fine. There was a male civilian held captive. According to him, Ashley's in a church somewhere. What happened to him? He managed to escape. Do you have a fix on the location of that church? No. But apparently there's a secret passage in the village that leads there. I'm heading back to the village. Oh man, where's Louise go? It was gonna be our new BFF and stuff. Oh. I miss Louise already. I'm so lonely. I'm just here in this village where everyone's trying to kill me, and over here, stranger. Oh man, oh man, that guy. Let me tell you about this guy. If Louise was gonna be our BFF, well, this guy, he really is our BFF for a lot of reasons that I'll get into in a second. Also, we got rifle ammo. That's not foreshadowing for anything. Well, <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. This section of the game is pretty much begging that you get this, a rifle. Something to snipe people with. Because as you can tell, you got a lot of people wandering, you need to take care of a lot of them. It makes it a lot easier in this part of the game. Got something that might interest you. <laughs> got a selection of Good things on sale, stranger. Oh man, this guy. This guy, he's the reason for the blue medallions. Yeah, that's right. He'll give us something special if we shoot 10 or more. We're gonna shoot all 15 because this guy put what him up and buying? let me tell you. I think people either love the merchant or hate the merchant from Resume 4. What are you buying? 
because he is amazing. Is that old stranger? <laughs> oh no, <laughs> man! You. This is why we what have so selling? much money. This is why we save up all our money. This is why, because we need to buy stuff from the merchant. He has amazing stuff, like the golden. Is that old stranger? <laughs> Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. Is that old? <laughs> Thank you. I can never get Is tired of listening stranger? to this all day. Is that old? <laughs> Thank you. Ah, uh, it's like. What are you buying? It's Is like that old joy and ecstasy <laughs> all mixed Thank up you. in one. Oh man, it's his voice is addicting like a drug. I need to get that rifle though. What are you selling? Okay, let me tell you something. Grenades, this is another reason is why I keep my stranger? grenades. <laughs> Thank you. I actually don't keep them to use them, I keep them to sell them. Is that all stranger? Handgun grenade. Thank you. What are you buying? Hand grenades sell for a pretty good price. Is that all stranger? Oh man, we got the rifle. Also, we upgraded our inventory, so we can hold a lot more. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, man. I want that scope. I really want that scope. Now, you are you might be wondering, can you kill the merchant? Yes, but I don't recommend it, because he dies. He's gone. And you don't want to kill him. He's, uh, he's really handy to have around. I mean, he's a store that carries stuff, upgrading stuff. You can upgrade weapons. I don't want to upgrade my weapons, not yet. But as you can see, we got sniping involved. I remember, Owl Flame was once telling me if they incorporate elements of sniping and horror survival, it's not really a good horror survival game. Because you should feel helpless when you're in these types of situations. Which, you know, I feel like. They took out a lot of horror survival elements, but put in a lot of action elements, and it, it's really good in my opinion. You still got a little bit of puzzle solving and everything, but, you know, it, it makes it up for Resident Evil, like I was saying. It makes it up. It was a good change of pace. Oh man, I was going to kick him. Oh, now I'm feeling kind of helpless. Now I'm feeling kind of helpless because I got hit with the pitchfork. He just straight up hit me. It wasn't good. It wasn't fun. There's a guy with dynamite. This is great. This is great. This is great for Shoddy right here because let me tell you something. Shoddy can take us out of this situation. Yeah, shotgun. When you're in a bind and you need to take care of this situation, shotgun helps a lot. Those guys are going suicide style. Suicide bomber style. I don't appreciate that. Oh man, rifle. That'd be good for this situation right here. Also, I need to heal up a little bit. We got some healing items. Yeah, you can use your rifle, but okay. They do kind of run up to you, and it's not so good. I like to try to avoid rifle guns as well. I mean, come on. Oh, reloading is at the worst time. That's not so good. How am I going to make it through this? Well, like I said, I'm not that confident at the game. I hate for you to get the wrong idea. Although I did kind of do that at the right time and didn't die. Alright, let's see. What can we do? We can use that increase our health for once. Yeah, it takes about four yellow herbs to actually upgrade one bar. Because you get like a quarter of a bar every time you upgrade. Did I shoot that dynamite with the shotgun? Oh man, that's that's skill right there. Except I don't have it, I just lucked out. <laughs> oh man, okay. If I can actually pull this off, this would be good. Because uh, you can get headshots with this. Really good headshots. Oh man, Chaz is trying to talk to me via Skype. But I'm doing parts on... I'm freaking Resident Evil, man. I gotta get this done. I gotta get this uploaded. I got actually, I really do have to upload. I haven't even uploaded one part. Uh, but it's okay. It's okay. I'm getting commentary done for this. And that's always good, you know. That's that's important because I'd like to have a couple parts. I'd like to have the week's worth of parts already, like done. So we got it. I'll take care of you. You know what I mean? And did I just headshot that guy? My God. Game. I'm telling you, I'm not that confident at you, but 
some reason you're just taking pity on me. Like, I'm amazing or something. But all I'm trying to do is, you know, not get chased by these guys. That, that's terrible. I don't like getting chased by these guys. Yeah, I know. We got some money. We can probably go back to the merchants and find it, but I'll be honest. That guy died. Uh, that's cool. We got this guy. I don't like him. I'm gonna kick him. And then can I shake him? Yeah! Oh man, there's like a bunch of guys. This isn't good. I don't like it. But there's like too many guys. That always makes me so nervous. There's a guy on the roof. You bastard! I'm gonna take care of you quick and fast in a hurry. I gotta keep going forward with this part. I'm gonna waste too much time. Time trying to figure out everything. We got hand grenade, that's, that's good. Well, okay, I guess I should call them what they are because they uh they got different names and there is an actual hand grenade and there's a guy right there. I guess I could just call them grenades, couldn't I? Because that's what they all are. Three types of grenades, one's a Molotov, one's just a flashbang, and the other one is an actual grenade grenade. You tried to kill me with a sickle. I don't like you. I'm gonna kick you and then I'm gonna shank you. Cause that's what you deserve. You deserve it so much. And you didn't drop anything, you bastard. 